Welcome, warrior. Greetings. If not for my woes, I'd rejoice in a swim with you. What concerns you? Let's talk. You mentioned woes. Terrible indeed. I lost my turquoise necklace as I swam in moonlight, a gift from the Lady of the Lake. Where did you swim? I usually bathe in the lake, yet that night I dared the river near the village. Sadly, the drowners abide there, led by Zephyr. Who's Zephyr? Once one of Vizima's most famous thieves. He moved as quietly as the wind, and quite handsome. And now? He once escaped to the sewers, but his loot proved too heavy. He joined the drowned dead, but old habits rarely die as easily. He still steals? Of course. Doubtless he stole my necklace. The drowners ever protect him. I'll search for your necklace. How wonderful! I have no gold with which to pay, but perhaps some trinkets could prove useful. It's a deal, then. I shall await you at the end of the beach, in an enchanting lagoon. How do I find Zephyr? If you slay enough drowners, he'll appear to discover the problem. Remember, drowners only venture out at night. Where do I find the drowners protecting Zephyr? They gather at night here on the shore. If you borrow a boat, you may reach the island where you'll find others. Some linger near the village. Who are you? A naiad, a water nymph. I serve the Lady of the Lake. Farewell.
I'll ask the Fisher King for permission. And I'm Geralt. Pleased to meet you. I don't speak your language. Your language I speak very well. Evidently. Let's talk. Kneel before lady. Speak easy. No kneel. Must be Dagonan and Patal. No speak. So I'm to pay tribute to the Lady of the Lake? Exact. All right. Got any work for someone skilled with a sword? Gul, bull. Humans great enemies to Vodianoi. Hire Witcher Big for Vodianoi to kill. Witcher Big at crypt. We love wish humans, yet humans swim our waters. Did I hear you right? Another Witcher? Gralol, exact. Disloving ghouls at crypt. I need to speak to him. Farewell. Oak. Gulpul Talhul. Everything all right? Great sadness. No peace in house. I'm sorry to hear that. Oak. Gulpul Talhul. What's Witcher in your language? Witch Malol Bull. Witch Malol? Witch Malol Bull. Bull must be. No, Bull means idiot. <laughs> All right, then I'm Witch Malol Bull. <laughs> yes, so you be. <laughs> Farewell. Greetings. You're the Fisher King, right? Mm hmm. Hmm. Well, I have a professional interest in the area. You see, I'm a witcher. Any monsters in the lake? Hmm. Amphis Benas? Dragonflies? Water creepers? No. Hmm. 
I see. The lake's safe. While we're talking. Mm hmm Could I use your boat? Mm hmm Take care.
Gerald. Dandelion. How did you get here? By teleport. Triss teleported me, too. It was amazing. I always wanted to see what it's like. She did that for you? Must be having an off day. So why did Triss teleport you here? Let's say she saved me from the kiss of death. Interesting. Perhaps I'll use it in my new ballad. In any case, what a truly delightful place. Triss said we should stay here until Princess Ada stops dreaming of slitting your throat. I have to agree. So, tell me about this place, in prose, if you don't mind. It's a charming area, thoroughly magical in its mood. The peasants seem altogether happy, while the peasant women are, uh, hmm. Dandelion, something specific? Well, there's going to be a wedding. Alina, the village mayor's daughter, will marry Julian, a wealthy merchant from Kovir. Then there, the Vodianoi. Oh, Alina's taking care of Alvin. Our Alvin? Well, yes, unless he has a twin. Dandelion. Yes. Oh, I just remembered. Triss said you should watch him since others are after him. Or something like that. Anything else? I don't think so. Now to the tavern to meet some charming lass who'll get my spirits up. 